Hello, my name is Robin and I work with the lab ADT, a lab based in Stoneham, Massachusetts. Our lab does a high volume of implant cases and today I'm going to walk you through scanning an implant case with the help of one of our CAD CAM technicians, Alex, using three shape and open implant scan bodies. We use a few different systems here, but we have found the open implant scan bodies are easy to use because of their design. They have a unique shape and the material used make a big difference too. First, we start at the order form. We are doing a screw retained crown, so we select that under abutment. Then we select the correct system we are using. We are doing a zimmer, so I select OI zimmer screw vent. Then we select the kit or size that we're doing, and we are doing a 3.5, so that's what we select. We do have a gingival mask, so we select this gingival scan. And now we are ready to go. Now that's done, and we will go ahead and insert the scan body into the model. Alex is inserting the scan body, and it sits nice and snug. He is now screwing down the screw with the appropriate driver. One note on these screws is that they are integrated and will not fall out. It is compatible with the manufacturer driver. Now we are ready for the first scan. We have the model in the scanner ready to go. You notice that we do not need to use CAD spray or powder because we do not have to. The top part is made of a peak material, which is great for scanning. The bottom of the scan body is metal, which is for durability, and you can see through a radiograph if using intraorally. After the first scan, you notice you can only see the top, but not the metal base. This is perfectly fine. As long as it is properly seated and the top is clear, that is all that's needed for the system to know the location. And again, the metal interface is great for durability and visibility in the x-ray. Here we are using three-point alignment. These scan bodies are great for this because there are three different sides, making it very easy to align. Now we are scanning the gingival mask. We removed the scan body, and for this we do need to use powder for the mask. Mask is done, and now we are scanning the antagonist. Last, we have the bite scan. We load this into the scanner. Still scan body is removed. We just needed that for the preparation scan and let it scan. And we are finished. This is how you scan an open implants case using the open implant scan bodies.